Welcome, Puyaka Puyaka. I'm your host, Tijani Musa. Welcome to La Verdad Dwelling Podcast. On this edition right here, we are going to talk about how to create an info sheet. Some people call it a fact sheet using Canva. And to do so, you go to canva.com and create a free account. And once you log in, this is what it's going to look like. Uh, Canva is a, a website that allows you to create uh, different things, logos, um, presentations, business cards, resume, posters, any type of thing that you need to create uh, for visual appeal, Canva is the way to go. And you can do so by creating a free account if you don't want to pay for uh, the other accounts. And the free account has lots of, lots of good information and lots of free templates that you can utilize. And let's get into this. Um, we are, when you log into Canva, it's gonna look like this. It's gonna say welcome and has your name or whatever information that you input. And on the search right here, we are going to search for informational sheet. So if you type in information sheet, you have options that are gonna come up and you just click enter. And then pretty much you can select from the list of uh, information that is provided to you. But for this session, I want to keep it short. And since we already uh, did this, I already selected the information sheet that I like. Uh, so, and I went ahead and fill it out because I don't want to walk you through the entire process of creating an informational sheet. I just want to show you that the option is available for free if you log into Canva and create a free account. And the one that I created looks like this one. And this was for a project that I was working on with my classmates. And it looks like this. It's very, very simple to, to do. So to add text, you pretty much just go here and click text. When you click text, you have the option to add a header, a heading or add a subheading. So depending on how big you want the letters to be, you can click either one of these and it should be able to provide you the information. So if I, if I click this, it gives me this option right here. And I should be able to type on this one right here. For example, I'm gonna say how to. And once I type on it, you see this, um, you see this right here? you should be able to move this thing by just clicking and holding on it. And you should be able to move it any way you want to. Uh, you can move it right here and then keep editing and then keep typing on it. It's typable. You can, you can type, you can change the text. Um, you can add new text, add new text. You can pretty much edit that. And if you want to delete it, you can also do that as well. Just by highlighting all of it and hitting delete. And if the text is already on there, you can also change it by just double clicking, uh, left double click, and you should be able to change the text and add new text, as you can see right here. Uh, since I already did this, and I don't want to bore you to death, we're just going to go ahead and show you how to change text. It's simple. And if you want to add a heading that has two different headers, like you should be typing the topic right here or the heading right here, and then you type the information on the other header, it's easy to do. You just look at these right here. If I click the one that says, for example, this one has two things right here, right? Uh, Marielle Price and Acting Director. So if you click, it says free right here. If you click on it, it brings it to your window right here. And now you should be able to type the topic right here, topic. And then on this one, you should be able to put the general information that you need for your info sheet or your fact sheet. And that should be easy. Again, you should be able to move this one very easily by just highlighting it and moving it to anywhere that you need to move it to. And you can also, you have accessibility to resize it, make it smaller or bigger, depending on 
how you want it to, to appear in your in your in your information sheet. And it's also easy to delete. You just highlight it and hit delete. And that's how you're able to do that. Um, so once you once you finish designing this, it's easy to download. All you have to do is you come to this right here, this three dots right here, and then it has the option right here to download. And you just click that option and you should be able to download it. And once you download it, you have the option to download it with a PDF or PNG or JPEG, depending on the kind of document that you created. And it should look like this. This one right here is a PDF copy that I created. And it's the same thing as the one that I just showed you previously. And this is the final copy right here. And it has the information that I needed to, uh, to pretty much advertise the information to the people that need to uh, get the information. So it's very easy. So just log into Canva and create a free account and you should be able to navigate uh, these different templates right here and adding and reducing information. So to get more of these videos, just comment on uh, the comment section of this video and let us know the type of videos that you like to see from Canva and I should be able to create those videos. And I will be able to create it, I will be able to create more content based on the demand. So if you want to see more of this and you want me to go into more details from the starting to how I got to this point, I will be able to do that by you giving me indication that that's what you want. And I wanted to keep this video short because I don't want to bore you. Like I said, it's very simple just going to Canva and creating a free account. But if you want me to give you more details on how to do this, just comment on the video and I should be able to do that. Uh, thank you very much for listening. And if you like what you see, please share this video with other people and comment and provide any feedback or suggestions that you need. Thank you.